the wonderful world of words. Good day everyone! My name is Alexis Tixiu of Grade 5F. Today, I would like to share three English words that you probably haven't heard of or are not aware of its origin yet. Last September 22, when Ta'al volcano erupted, we were told to strictly wear N95 masks and stay indoors to prevent from getting pneumono ultra microscopic silico volcano coniosis. Pneumono what? That is a 45 letter word and the longest word in the English language. Coined in 1935 by Everett M. Smith, Mono Ultra Microscopic Silica Volcanoconiosis is a lung disease caused by the inhalation of very fine silica dust usually found in volcanoes. It can be broken down as follows. Mono is long, Ultra is extremely, Microscopic is tiny, Silico is silicon, Volcano is volcano, Coni is dust, and osis is a medical condition. And there you have it, our first word for the day. Did you know that I took a 10 session taekwondo class last summer? Our second word is taekwondo, which can be broken down into three Korean words. Tai means to kick with a foot, Kwan means to punch or strike with a hand, and Do means art or way. That is why Taekwondo is a Korean martial art involving punching and kicking techniques. I recently watched Ratatouille in Disney Plus and got curious about this hard to spell and pronounce word that sounds like a rat, but it's actually a type of dish. It is spelled as R-A-T-A-T-O-U-I-L-L-E and pronounced as ra ta tu -i with a silent L. Ratatouille is a French dish made with tomato, eggplant, zucchini, and peppers, as well as onion, garlic, and herbs. And that's my third and last word. Thank you for listening and I hope you learned something from me. Welcome to the wonderful world of words. See you next time! Bye-bye!